Hi, this is Carol and welcome to my studio. The name of this painting is Expand Your Imagination, Freeform Abstract, 30 by 30 inch. This is the painting hanging on the wall under a spotlight. And this is the painting in broad daylight. Here I begin my painting on the prepared canvas of the heavy gel and the white gesso dabbed with the cellophane wrapper of the canvas. My first coat on the canvas is going to be in the pastel shades and I worked with the cobalt blue and the turquoise blues blended with titanium white to get it very pastel here and there. Kevin, yeah, move around the canvas doing this so we can just sit back and watch me paint for right now until I start blocking in some of the forms. You'll notice that here I'm starting to define more of the forms. And I continue to do that throughout the painting. And you notice I don't use any measuring device at all. It's just strictly free, loose, and spontaneous. This is where you can get your imagination to grow. Now, I do stop periodically and I stand back and I take a look at what I've done so far. You know, I get an idea of the forms that I've already blocked in and where I want to go with that. And at the same time, I start visualizing what colors I'm going to add into this painting to start making it brilliant. And of course, you can glance over at a color wheel periodically if you need to. I always have one handy. However, I've been painting for so long that it's just like, embedded in my memory. So we'll just sit back and watch me paint. And everything is pretty self-explanatory. Uh, one point that I do want to mention that's very important is that I use the spatula in this painting quite a bit because I want to show the texture that I laid in in the beginning of the painting with that heavy gel mixture. And then when I dapped it on with the cellophane wrapper, I created a lot of texture. And this shows up when you use the spatula or if you're dry brushing. And that is basically one of the assets of this painting is the thickness and the heaviness that it shows with the paint. And you'll see this at the very end of the video. I do have photographs of close-ups of the canvas. And you'll be able to see exactly what I'm talking about. 
When I do put in bright colors, such as this one I just laid in, which was the yellow and green blend, I will be toning that definitely back down. I just want this somewhat in the background because a little bit will show up when I'm finished with the painting. It's almost a technique that you use in Impressionism when you're painting landscapes or seascapes. Let's listen to the music and watch me paint until the end of this video. And I want to thank everyone for stopping in to view this painting in process. And also, I really appreciate it if you haven't subscribed to please do so, so you can get notification of my next videos. My heart away went a bit too far.